Hello, this is Jose with Joma Wraps, and today we are wrapping a mirror on a new Toyota Highlander. The steps that need to be taken is, of course, pick the film of, that the client wants, measure the area that needs to be wrapped. It's about two feet, the height would be about a foot. So what we're gonna do is just measure out what we need, which is about a foot, and then we'll just cut it, and we can get the two mirrors out of this. And then we move on to the actual mirror where we prep the surface of the mirror with the uh, isopropyl alcohol and water. Using the edge of my squeegee to get on the edges of the, the mirror. I'm gonna do it in uh, two pieces just for durability. I know that the vinyl is gonna be stressed here, so I'll put one piece underneath and then I'll do the rest of it. I'm gonna use knifeless tape so I don't cut on the vehicle. I heated it to stretch the film to just get around this uh, complex curve here on the side of the mirror. And I'm just making relief cuts so it can just kind of conforms easier. So this, you know, allows me to cut the film without cutting on the car. And just provides that straight, you know, nice line. Added the uh, alcohol so I could glide smoother on the vinyl. This particular vinyl is meant to stretch, so it'll stretch 130% of what the original film is without compromising the quality of performance of the vinyl. If you overstretch it, of course, it has memory and it's gonna wanna return. You know when you stretch it too far, when it starts whiting out, because it starts stretching out and it separates the color from the film. When you feel the adhesive side and it just doesn't stick anymore, you just, you just overdid it, you know? Right now I'm just conforming the vinyl to the edge of the mirror, ready for trim. I already wrapped it around the knifeless tape area, so I'm about to pull that. So that's knifeless is done. And then the only part I need to trim is like the outside edge of the mirror where, you know, if you finally cut that, you don't damage anything. So it's a wrap with the mirror. We completed both driver and passenger side mirrors. We went with the 3M1080 gloss black metallic, which changed it from white to this nice metallic finish we have here. I did an inlay piece just to help the durability of it and be long-term. Uh, it's basically ready after we post-heated the vinyl to 200 degrees and squeegee it out. But you're good to go. I would give it a few days to settle, and after that you can car wash it, hand wash it. It will withstand any weather. Uh, let us know if you have any questions or concerns. Please inbox us, like us, and subscribe to our channel.